Hey guys, and welcome back or welcome if you're new. I hope you're all having a great day so far. Today I have a collective haul to share with you guys. I've been purchasing things um, over the last month or so. So I have some things from Amazon, a few things from Ross, and then some things from Home Goods to share with you. And if this does happen to be your first time here, welcome. My name is Wendy. I mostly do Dollar Tree hauls on my channel, and I also do some crafting videos and Cricut tutorials. But every once in a while, I like to throw in hauls from other stores. Um, so that's what we're going to be doing today. And if you do like these kinds of videos, I would love a thumbs up. And if you aren't currently subscribed, I hope you will join the family and subscribe on your way out. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started with the things that I found at Home Goods. And I actually went to this store for the first time yesterday. I've always heard about Home Goods, but I've never actually been in that store until yesterday. And let me tell you, I got quite a few things. So I did pick up a couple of coffee mugs. And I can't go into any sort of home, uh, I guess, home decor store without purchasing mugs. I love coffee mugs. So I did pick up this Ray Dunn mug. And this was $5.99. Now, I am not like an avid Ray Dunn collector. I have a few pieces. I have a couple of like planter pots. I don't think I have any mugs. So this is my first Ray Dunn mug. This was the only one that I found um, for Halloween. I'm probably late to the game. Um, but I decided to go ahead and pick one up for my coffee bar. I have a lot of coffee bar items from Home Goods. But yeah, I think the price is good on these. I have a lot of Ray Dunn dupes that I've done on my channel um, DIYs that I like to do but I decided to go ahead and pick this up. And then I also found this cute mug with this owl spider web and pumpkins and bats. And this was $3.99. So I was pretty impressed with the prices in home goods. I felt like it was comparable to um, maybe Ross, at least the things that I was looking at. So $3.99 for a mug is probably what I would pay at Ross. So I was pretty happy with the prices. But I love this mug. I love how it kind of looks like something you'd find in a pottery store. And I just fell in love with it. So it had to come home with me. So I picked that up for, again, $3.99. The next several items that I'm going to show you guys I found in the checkout area of Home Goods. I did pick up a couple of candles. So I found this one, which was $9.99, and it is by Red Leaf Home. And I'm not sure if that is a brand or a candle company that is. I guess exclusive to home goods because again this was my first time going into that store but this is a two wick candle and it has a wooden top to it with an engraved pumpkin and it smells so good it smells like pumpkin and vanilla that is the notes that i'm getting it doesn't actually list the notes on the bottom of the candle but bath and body works candles i love them but they're very expensive um, and I will only purchase them if they're on sale. So I felt like this was a good price. I'm not sure if the throw on it is going to be as strong as a Bath In Body Works candle, but I thought I would go ahead and try it out. So picked that one up. And then I also picked up another candle from Red Leaf Home and I got it because I thought the saying on it was hilarious. It says, it's not drinking alone if the dog is home which I thought was so funny. And this one has a paw print on the lid and this one was $6.99 for a single wick. And the smell on this is a fall scent, but it's a spicy and sweet scent. I'm picking up maybe some cinnamon and some other spice and maybe some vanilla in this. So it does have a very good fall scent to it. A little bit more complex than the other candle, but I couldn't pass it up. I just thought it was hilarious and I do have three dogs. So picked up that. And these next items I picked up for my coffee bar. So I found some coffee syrups and this was only $6.99 for three syrups. They're all caramel 
flavors. So you have salted caramel or caramel, vanilla caramel, and caramel pecan. And these are by Jordan Skinny Syrup. So they're all zero calorie, zero sugar coffee syrup. So I think these would look really cute in my coffee bar. So I picked up those and I found these disposable coffee cups also in the checkout area. All of these things I found in the checkout area, the candles, the syrups, these coffee, disposable coffee cups in these tubes. You get 12 of them. And I did open them up to show you guys the print on them. So I kind of have a witch theme going on this year. It wasn't intended. I was trying to do Beetlejuice, but it turned into be a witch theme. But each cup has a sleeve. And then this one just, let me turn the lighting down. This one just has a witch print on it since 1692, which is brew. And then it says brewed with only the finest all natural ingredients in the grand tradition of Salem's finest witches. So I thought that was adorable. And these will probably last me several years. I'll probably just put a few out on my coffee bar. So if I want to take a coffee to go, or if I have company over and they want to take a coffee to go, I can set these out and also decorate my coffee bar at the same time. So I think these are really cute. So I found those ones. And then I found this set, which says, Hocus Pocus, I need coffee to focus. So I thought this was really cute. I actually did a coffee bar um, mug holder DIY and I put this saying on it. So I think it matches really well with the theme of my coffee bar. And again, these do come with 12 sleeves and then 12 lids as well. So these ones are orange and black, and then these ones were black and white. So I have a little bit of a variety with those. So these were each $4.99, which I thought was a really good price for some cute cups. So picked up those and I put this back like twice because I was like, I don't need this. But then I put it back in my cart. It is some butter toffee popcorn. Toffee is my favorite kind of candy. I'll eat toffee with anything, but I thought this would also look cute with my coffee bar to decorate and then also to eat just because of the label on here and then the black lid. And this was $4.99 as well for some gourmet popcorn. So I went ahead and picked up that. I found a few items also at Home Goods for my kitchen. So I found this drying rack with mat for $7.99. And I use my dishwasher, but I also hand wash some things. And if there's not a lot of dishes to do, I'm not going to run my dishwasher. So I like to hand wash those things. And I like this because it has um, spots to put your plates because I always struggle with that. <laughs> I'm always like leaning things on top of each other. So I thought this was pretty neat. So I went ahead and picked up that for $7.99. And I've always wanted one of these expanding or collapsible colanders <laughs> for my sink. I've wanted one of these things for years. I've just never purchased one but this was $12.99 and it just hangs on to the edges of your sink and you can wash your veggies in a colander so I picked that up I thought it was pretty neat and it pops back into place for compact storage so picked up that while I was in home goods I decided I wanted to start the project of organizing my refrigerator and making everything look pretty. I've been really into organizational videos, especially the fridge organization and the pantry um, organization. Sometimes I stay up late at night and I'll watch TikToks or Instagram videos and watching people organize their refrigerators for some reason is super satisfying to me. And so I decided in Home Goods that I was going to do it. So I picked up a bunch of clear organizational bins. They had an entire um, aisle 
of bins like this. So I found quite a few um, different styles and sizes to organize. This is a set, this was $9.99. They are stackable. So there's two different pieces here. So I could maybe put my veggies in it or drinks, um, snacks, things like that. So I picked up this size and I may need to go back and either return um, what I don't use or pick up different sizes. I just decided to pick up a few different um, sizes to start. And then I got two of these, these were $3.99 and they do have a little handle on them. So maybe I could put my daughter's snacks in here for school. I do pack her a lunch. So maybe her juice boxes or um, snacks, maybe her fruit cups I could put in here. You could also use these for your pantry as well. So these were $3.99 for those. And then I got two sets of this size. So, Two come in a pack or two for $7.99 for these. So I think these would be perfect, again, for like juice boxes or um, like to-go um, proteins or to-go snacks I could put in there. So I picked up two sets of those. And again, these were $7.99 a piece. Picked up those and then I got a set of this size for $9.99 and these are stackable and this is by the company Bino. These two right here are the same brand. So I don't know, I'll maybe post a picture on my Instagram or something after I'm done organizing my refrigerator so you guys can maybe see a before and after. I'm really excited to get started on that project. So picked those up and also in the kitchenware section, I found this cake cover for $9.99 and it is plastic. They had a bunch of really beautiful, elegant um, cake covers with a stand, but I just wanted something plain. I didn't want anything over the top because I want to be able to switch it out um, during different holidays and seasons on my coffee bar and display muffins or cookies in it. I might actually turn this into a DIY and add maybe a Dollar Tree candle um, pillar underneath just to give it some height. But I don't know, I just picked it up because I've been wanting to display muffins and cookies on my coffee bar and also keep them fresh. So I picked up that. And then the very last thing that I picked up at Home Goods was for my dogs. I got this elevated dog dish holder for $29.99. And I loved the wooden detail on here. And the bowls are quite large. I have two large dogs and then I have one smaller dog. And he already has an elevated, my smaller dog has an elevated dog dish, but I needed one for my big dogs. All right, so that is everything that I picked up at Home Goods. Now let me show you guys the things that I found at Ross. I only picked up, I think, three things, starting with this soap dispenser. It is glass, which I love because I can refill this over and over again. And it's just really beautiful and elegant looking, and I paid $5.99 for this. So picked that up. And I got this really big wooden decor piece for $19.99. It is very large and very heavy. So I thought I could maybe put this on my front porch or even um, in my house somewhere. I might actually use it for my coffee bar, actually, just because I really love the colors on it. So that was $19.99. And the very last thing I picked up at Ross was this table runner for $7.99. I have it set out on my entryway table and I love the witch theme and the black stripes. All right, so that was everything from Ross. Now let me show you guys the things that I've purchased off of Amazon over the last month or so, starting with this set of throw pillow covers. They come in a set of four, and I believe at the time I paid $13.99 for these um, a few weeks ago, but with Amazon, the prices can go up and down, so um, they could be more or less, but I will leave everything linked down below for you guys. 
um, from Amazon so you can go check it out for yourself and see if the price is right for you. But I love buying throw pillow covers versus buying a whole throw pillow because um, it saves space when you buy just throw pillow covers. I don't have the space to keep purchasing new throw pillows so I have been purchasing just the covers and just switching them out from season to season and these do have a zipper on each one so I can wash it and easily remove them so really happy about these and then I also bought these throw pillow covers as well these came in a pack of two and these ones are very soft and I wanted to do a Beetlejuice theme this year that's why I purchased these throw pillow covers but I don't think that's going to happen but I still think they're beautiful and again I can just switch these out from season to season I'll probably use these in February as well um, to decorate so picked up those and I also like to switch out my bedding from season to season it's just a fun way that I can be festive and also decorate my bedroom so I recently purchased this duvet cover behind me and it has this beautiful macrame thing going on there's two rows of it and I absolutely love this and I actually saw this on Etsy first but it was a lot cheaper on Amazon I saw it both on Etsy and Amazon so I went ahead and purchased it from Amazon so picked up that and this is very lightweight which I have to have lightweight bedding here in East County, San Diego because it never really gets cold. It's always very hot. So I'm really excited about this purchase and it also came with matching pillowcases. And then I also picked up this quilt set from Amazon as well in this burnt orange color. I think it's gorgeous. I'm really into the earthy tones right now. And that's kind of the color scheme that I have going on in my room. And I just think that the burnt orange goes well with fall. And this quilt is also very lightweight and it also came with two pillow covers. Another purchase from Amazon for me this month were these industrial farmhouse looking shelves that I put in my living room. I purchased two of them and I absolutely love how they look. I love the metal pipe industrial look. I have that going on in my dining room as well. And they were super easy to assemble and I do believe that they sell a five shelf option as well That's just a little bit shorter, but I went ahead and purchased the six shelf option So highly recommend these you can fit lots of little knickknacks on These shelves, which is what I did and the reason why I purchased them just because I didn't have a lot of um, shelving or areas to put um, my decorations so I love how these turned out and love how they look in my living room and the last two things that I purchased from Amazon this month were for caregiving needs I take care of my grandfather um, so I needed to buy a back brace or a lifting um, belt to be able to lift him out of bed and into a chair um, and this has been a lifesaver for me because I am lifting him from a sitting position and unfortunately he can't stand or walk anymore. So I am lifting, um, basically like dead lifting weight. And so this has really helped save my back and it does come with a removable lumbar support pad that just Velcros on here. And I just keep this on all the time because I need it, but I think I purchased this in the extra large size. It's very comfortable to wear. I don't know if this would be good for maybe um, like everyday use weightlifting. I'm not a weightlifter, so I don't know. But if you are a caregiver or maybe um, you lift heavy things at work, I think this is great. It's very comfortable and highly recommend this and the very last thing is this pager system or call button system it comes with two lanyards 
with a help button and then it comes with a receiver that plugs into the wall and then a portable receiver and so this has been awesome so that my grandpa doesn't have to yell um, when he needs help he can just press his button we keep one plugged into the living room and then our portable receiver we take with us if we're going outside on our patio or something. So it's been a lifesaver and I highly recommend this if you are a caregiver or if you um, maybe are having a surgery or somebody's taking care of you and you don't wanna have to yell for help, you have this little cool button that you can press and it just sends out a chime and then you have help right away. All right guys, so that was everything for this collective haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up if you did. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And again, I will link everything down below from Amazon. I don't think I can link um, the things from Home Goods, um, but I will link those things from Amazon down below if you guys are interested in checking it out for yourself. And until my next video, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one.